Hello everyone, welcome to my Steam World Dig Let's Play. Uh, I've actually beaten this game once. It's a very good game, just gotta say that, put, get that out of the way. But anyways, this is gonna be a, a series. I'm not exactly sure how much I'm gonna get to upload this, but let me tell you, I will try to upload it as much as possible. So you guys can't see if I already have my old slot, so we're gonna start a new slot. So you guys probably don't know this, but I don't exactly like to read uh, any of the dialogue. But basically, he found a cave, he needs to get out, and there's only one way out. I forget, but yes, he got this mine from his uncle. Not exactly sure how robots have uncles, but whatever. So, let's go this way. Now this game is very cool, uh, if you guys like Minecraft or Terraria, you guys will probably like this. And how is he a skeleton, or is that just how he looks? I don't know. Let's just see. We kind of skip through all that, but we have an old pickaxe. And now we can get out of here. This game is actually sort of like Metroid, uh, you got like new upgrades and stuff. So, I think that's pretty cool. I never really was a big fan of the Metroid series. I haven't really played any of them. But, yeah. So, it's cool. So, anyways, we have to find a lever. I think it's down here. Let me get down here. But, yeah. This uh, this game is very cool. Uh, it was on sale yesterday. But, anyways. So, let's go over here. Go down here, continue going down here, and come on, I gotta get down, I gotta get down, <laughs> I'm sorry, it's hard to control when you're not exactly holding the 3DS in a correct fashion, alright, so here's the lever, alright, so let's get out of here, and we can wall jump like a Mega Man. <laughs> That's actually really cool. I love wall jumping. I think later we uh, unlock like a double jump. But, but that's like at the end of the game, I'm pretty sure. I don't know why they kept it so far in, but whatever. Next, let's continue. Now we're up here in Tumble Tumbleton. Tumbleton, I don't even know. So anyways, she's just saying that she's gonna buy ore from us. So yeah. Let's go down here. There's actually some ore right here. I hope we unlock a better pickaxe soon. And oops, I accidentally turned my volume like really far up. Anyways, there's a little monster right there. And it broke free. Don't like that. I usually, uh... I usually avoid all the monsters because I hate them and I never ever want to touch them. Well, I don't want to. Well, I don't know. They're just hard to fight. I usually die a lot if I try fighting them. But now that I'm more experienced with the game, I probably won't die as much. Alright. So, let's just. I'll just do this. This seems to work okay. Alright. I think the only reason I bought this game, well, whenever I, I don't even remember when I got this, I just had it in my, in like some random folder I have on my 3DS. But any, anyways, the only reason I got this game was because of uh, BNGR. He's a guy who does videos. But anyways. I just wanted to get that out of the way, because if it wasn't for him, I would have no idea what this game was, and would have never really bought it. But yeah. So let's get up here. Let's go sell. 
We made seven dollars. I can't exactly buy anything yet. And oops, my 3DS isn't aligned with the camera. Uh, let's go this way. I hate recording like this because I don't have like I don't have any of, I don't have like my 3DS cradle. But yeah. Oh, I gotta go sell my stuff. I forget that you only start off with three inventory slots, actually. Alright, let's get out of here. If you guys saw at the beginning of the video, I was just actually, I had like a game called Pix 3D ex Suspended. That game is like really cool. It's like a puzzle game, sort of. Where, I don't even know how to explain it. You just have to go uh, watch like the, the trailer or something. I don't know. It's really cool, you guys should go check that out. But, let's get the sharp pickaxe. Alright, now we have the sharp pickaxe. Let's go back to the mine. Oh wait, we have to talk to her for some reason. Alright, she was just telling us that the, the um, pickaxe we just bought will upgrade our dirt pet. Well, not capacity, I mean how much dirt we can mine. So now, I think we can break those with one hit. And now we can dig up at like actual dirt because this is just like gravel. But now we can go down here. This dirt was too hard to mine before. I didn't show it because I already knew that we couldn't mine it. Man, all of this ore is really cheap. Like later in the game, uh, you can like mine diamonds, I think, and those are worth like a hundred dollars. And uh, a lot of the ore in the later game is like worth a lot more. But right now we're just in the slow part of the game. But it'll get more fun soon. Soon enough, at least. Oh yeah, one thing I forgot to mention is that, that the uh, mine is actually randomized every time you play through. And there's actually a thing down here that we have to go do. This will be sort of hard to do because of the way I'm holding the 3DS. But... Yeah, probably in episode 2 I'll fix how I'm holding this, because I cannot play like this. And I'll probably be playing worse. Well, I'll, I'll be playing better, but I won't be able to record as good. Alright, here's where we need to go. There. Alright. So we have to break this. Alright. You have to like jump across there. Oh god. I don't think I got hit. Alright, we got a wall jump up here. You guys are probably gonna see my finger go insane trying to play right now. And of course I did not do that correctly. I've actually been playing a lot of Harvest Moon lately instead of Animal Crossing. I actually haven't played Animal Crossing very much recently. I don't know why, I just stopped. I guess it's because I'm getting really far, well not really far into Harvest Moon, but I'm in like my second year of the game. And why can I not, do I have to go to over here? Is this, am I just being retarded? Yeah, I'm just being retarded right now. I have to go over here. But we really don't need to go up there, I think. I don't, I'm pretty sure we don't need to go up there. Anyways, we have the speed boot, so the way we run is like this. Wait. Oh wait, we have to do a running jump now. This might be a little bit of a problem. Right, let's just go down here and go back to town. And we can sell all of our ore if we have to. I'm out of room in my inventory. Uh, which way is way up? Okay, up here. At least the mine isn't like super confusing right now. Because when I uh, was playing through this game for the first time, my mind got like insanely confusing and I kept on getting lost and I think it, when I beat the game it said I died like 53 times because of like most of those deaths were either because of how confusing my mind was 
or for me self-destructing because I couldn't find my way out. Anyways, we had to buy some stuff. So I want to get the copper pickaxe, but I, well, I, like there's a ladder that we can buy, but I don't want to buy it right now. We really don't need it currently, but there might be a situation where we need it. Because I'm starting to forget that I'm still broke right now, and I got to keep on realigning my 3DS, not paying attention to the camera. Oh yeah, I forgot that I can't take, I can't uh, fall without taking damage yet. Alright, then there's a little torch right here. Like, I don't, like, it's really weird because, like, I guess his uncle was the one who put the torches there. Where are all of his tunnels? Because they're really not there. Like, that'd be cool. Like, if you saw some of his tunnels or something. I don't know. Oh god. Okay, first time we died. Well, I think I'm just going to end this episode right here because we're already 11 minutes in. Next time, we'll probably have a lot of money or something. I don't know. But I hope you guys enjoyed. My name's Justin. I'll see you guys later. Bye.